Story of the Week The Village Without Colors It exists a little village that all people accept to live there without questioning what exists outside. The inhabitants of that village called this place the village without colors. And they never confront why the village does not have colors. There, all people accept that, but they never take risks to search for other villages with colors. However, it exists a village which has beautiful colors. The people call it the village of dreams. Where the colors complete each little thing there. This village is a faraway place, and it is situated on the top of a mountain. There are many myths about it. The first myth says that those who want to get there have to defeat monsters along the way. And those monsters take advantage of every human weakness. To get there it would not be easy. But in the end, everything will be worth it. In the village without colors, there is a man young with 26 years old with no brothers or sisters. He wants to discover and to find more things. His dream is to go to the village of dreams to see the world as never before. When he started to talk about that to his friends, they called him crazy. But he kept believing it was possible to get what he wanted. One night at the house, he wanted to talk with his family about what he wanted to do. His parents were sitting near him at the table. And they didn't know what he wanted. He entered the room and sat down at the table. Dad, Mom. He said. I will go on a journey alone to realize my dreams. His parents didn't know what to say, but they kept listening patiently. I will go to the village of dreams. His father more amazed started asking. James, are you crazy? The mother was quiet just listening to what her husband was saying. That village is far away and had two people that never came back. The father claimed worried. The mother also said. No, my son. What do you want with your life? In this village, you have all that you need. James looked at the eyes of his parent and he argued. You are right, I have all that I need here. But, our village looks so graceless. Because everybody looks unhappy. I mean, they are doing things they don't like. Here everybody just survives. And nobody appreciates the existence. I want to get out of here to see everything colorful. His mother was trying to convince him. Yes James, I understand that here we do not have colors, but it is still our home. Mom, I understand you. But I want to know why the village of dreams is so incredible. But son, that place can be just a myth. We do not even know if it is real. The father said. Yes dad, I cannot find what I want, although I believe. I want to know how they can see everything with colors and to be so happy. I know it will be difficult. But what is easy in life? We will not be able to save you when you go. Think carefully about it. The father said. I will go today mom, dad. His father was looking at his wife before to say more things. James, we cannot convince you although just think how it would be for us and your friends. Dad, I will come back and I will try to find a way to see colors in our village as well. It is okay James, we just want you to know that we love you, the father said with tears. His mother also agreed. People of other villages also knew about the existence of that village. Although they have fear of climbing the mountain to get there. Now far away from where he came from. He noticed that the place where he was did not have colors too. He was looking at the map he found in the book, it showed the directions to where he wanted to go. The more he walked, the further he got from home, until he got closer to the mountain. The mountain had a way to get to the top, but he had fear. Inside his mind, millions of thoughts happened. Until now, nothing happened. But what will happen when I climb the mountain? He wanted to give up and he had a fear of monsters described in his book. However, nothing of that made him not take the first step. I will not give up. What I want is to be on the top of this mountain. Tired he took the first step and start walking with cold. At the beginning of the way, he started noticing some kind of dark monsters in the way. 
They looked like a human but they had dark characteristics. In the beginning, he was afraid. But after he learned to control his fears that he had. And a monster appeared in front of him. I don't fear you. James said. Yes, you do not have fear. But do you know what we can do with you? James, you are weak. Just go back to your village. Wait, how did you know my name? James asked amazed. So, the monster said. We can know everything you have in your mind. And we know you don't believe 100% in yourself. Yes, I have doubts, and I don't know if I can find what I want. Although I am determined and strong to keep going. When they understood that he was so determined, the monster started to create illusions in his head. But he answered with a strong determination. I won't fall into your trap. I know very well what I know and what I want to be. Life is made of challenges. Even with all illusions or monsters he didn't stop. He was almost there fighting like a warrior. The monsters didn't stop even when he was eating. He learned how to ignore all of them with willpower. He understood that the monsters can only cause psychological harm. Which means they cannot do any physical damage. But unfortunately for the monsters, James knew a lot of himself deeply. One of the best ways to fight against them is to have deep self-knowledge. James noticed that and all the hours he had with himself helped him a lot. Close to the end, he was psychologically tired. At that moment he started seeing some colors for the first time. Even tired, he hurried the steps. And when he finished to climb the mountain, James became amazed at so much beauty and his eyes were shining. He was crying not because he was sad, but because he was happy with the situation. He has never seen how beautiful the colors are. The village of dreams looked like a place with particles of light. He doesn't remain there for a long time. Then, he decided to walk through the gate. Some minutes later, he was approached by a young woman. Hello. Welcome to our village. She said with a smile. James didn't know what to say, he was distracted by contemplating all the beautiful things there. I am sorry, I was seeing how your village is beautiful. Yes, I also agree with you. The woman agreed with James. What is your name? The woman asked. My name is James. My name is Emily, nice to meet you. James was talking with her and at the same time, he was admiring each little thing. While Emily was showing him the place, James asked. What do you do to have colors in this village? Because the place where I live does not have colors. Yes James, I know that. Many people who came here don't go back, they just choose to stay here. Now I know why some people never come back. James concluded. Emily, what can I do to have colors in my village? Well it is simple, the village which has more shines can attract colors. The colors in this world are attracted by people who change the way how they live. For example, here we learn that to love our existence is important. Emily explained. In this world exists the rule of happiness. What do you mean by the rule of happiness? James asked with excitement. It is the rule which attracts more colorful things to your life. In this village, all people understand it and follow this little rule. I will need to stay here for a time to learn how it works. James concluded. Wait, do you want to implement this rule in your village? Emily asked surprised. Yes Emily. James lived in the village for six months to learn what they learned. He also learned that the monsters he encountered only existed to let the right person to find the village. After he acquired the knowledge of what he wanted, he went back to change his village. Children and adults became fascinated about what he was teaching. Years have passed and now his teachings change the village without colors. Now it is a magnificent place with many colors. If you are new, do not forget to subscribe and to give a big like if you like the video.